Good afternoon, everyone. Hope you can hear me. Uh, I hear we are number 36 in the list. Number 36 in the list today, so hopefully we'll try to make it simple and quick and easy to understand for all of you. Uh, my name is Satish. Uh, I'm from Orion Business Innovations based out of New Jersey. Uh, we, uh, and I have Sachin, my partner out here. Uh, we, we, we live in New Jersey and uh, have an office out here in New York. What we're here to present today is uh, Fintigrate, a very simple, effective, and easy to use data validation tool. Uh, <clears throat> Sachin, do you know that, you know, I was just reading something in Gartner and they say that in data validation and data quality, the Fortune 1000 companies, an average loss of revenue is about $8.2 million. And surprisingly, about 22% of them tell that it is 20 million, not 8.2. Wow. And about 4% of them tell that it's about $100 million. That's and huge, Satish. That's a huge number. And this got me thinking, saying that, haven't we done something like this for one of our clients? And uh, that's how Fintigrate started. And uh, wanted to tell yeah. what Fintigrate's all about. That's right, Satish. Uh, that's a huge number. And that's why this product is so important. It, it seems very simple. Uh, but it is very effective. Uh, so what is Fintigrate? Fintigrate in simple terms is nothing but an intelligent gatekeeper for all your integrations. We know that integration is so important in this industry that we are part of, right? Every firm needs to integrate with some or the other entity in order to ensure the entire end-to-end -end process. What Fintigrate brings to the table is it ensures that each of your integration with each of their unique data requirements are maintained separately, or you can manage it separately, all from a one uh, easy portal. It is easy to add a channel. Uh, it's a one, two, three click process to add a channel. You can add a file, add a sample file, and the system will self-configure itself to the file validations and to the business rule validations. Now, you may ask, how does it do it for the business rule validation? I can understand that I provide a file. It reads the, uh, the headers of the file. It reads what data it is, and it self-configures, saying that, OK, these are the, this, this should be the delimiters. This should be the headers. This should how the, uh, the data type should be. But for business rule val validations, we have an AI engine, engine in the back. What it does is it basically uh, takes your file, makes sense of what that file is, in terms of the industry, and then tries to bring out business rule validations to ensure that the data that flows over that channel ensures and that the data quality is maintained. So I'm going to quickly demo what, what we have. I'm logged in as a, uh, one of those uh, integrator firms here, and I'm integrating with multiple banks. Each bank has their own requirements. So what you see here is I'm logged in as bank A, and, and you can see that we have two parameters that we kind of measure. Uh, one is the integrity, one is the validity. Validity is nothing but your file format, your schema validations. Integrity is your business rule, your, how the data that is flowing on that channel, is that a really valid data that you want to send out to your destination? And uh, down below, if you see, it's a quick list of all your validations in, in one place. Uh, it is giving you what failed, what passed, if it failed, it kind of uh, you know, sends out notifications as needed. And I'm going to quickly show how easy it is to add a channel. Right? This screen looks very simple. It's one, two, three. But there are three important features that, that behind the scene make this a simple screen very, very effective. I'm going to add something, another bank here called Bank B. And what you notice straight away is, Fintigrate is providing you with a set of templates out of the box pertaining to those particular uh, requirements. It, it identifies that you're connecting to Bank B. It has a set of requirements, and you can connect to it. I can select what file I need. And if I have a specific file, I can go and upload that file as well. I say, OK, I need this sample file here, and I'm done. All I need to then specify is how, where is the data available to the tool. For ease of use, I'm going to just say it's available on my local path here. And it's done. Now, you see what happened here is based on the template that I selected and based on the file that I uploaded, it came back with certain suggestions as far as the business rules are concerned. right? And the other easy part, what Fintigrate brings to the table is 
integration need not be in the hands of IT always. You have business users who can come in and write uh, English phrase-like test cases here. So I'm going to quickly do a very simple use case here. All right. And say the test objective is to validate loans, loan payments, say, for example. And you'll see here it follows a specific construct and say, OK, when account ID is, say, 0001 and customer ID. So these terms that you're seeing here, it's coming back from your file that you uploaded. So it understands the context and is able to allow you to create those business case scenarios. Right? So it is what, and then you can obviously go and schedule it. You can uh, uh, run it uh, as you want. The whole idea behind this is making the whole process of ensuring data flow on a specific channel very user friendly. Sure. So thanks, Sachin. And um, as you can see, this is not this testing validation is done during the time of integration, not at the source or not at the target. It's actually during the time of integration. I believe we can do thousands of files at the same Absolutely. time. We have our thousands of templates, and then a user can create their own templates runtime while it can. So it keeps adding to it. It's got an AI-based engine. It's actually very easy to configure. It can be done both on technology rules and business rules, right? Looks very simple, but a real true case for us is that for one of the customers that we have done it, it saved about 30% cost in terms of data validations. And just not that, but also just imagine when one bank talks to another, one, one financial services talks to another, it's the amount of communication channels that open up, right? So how do you decrease that? So this is something that, as I said, is a very simple data validation integration tool. We believe that there's a lot of value in it. Um, we are at booth 19. Please come, feel free to come and visit us, and we'll be more than happy to showcase our tool. Thank you very much. Thank you.